Hey guys, it's Michael here from Tech and Tools, and today um, I'm going to be having an unboxing and look at new Fifine condenser microphone. So yeah, let's get into it. Okay, okay. A little bit of damage from shipping, but no big deal. That's what's in here is good. It should be. So let's have a look at this. So first we've got user's guide and the main microphone. Place the stand. So we go. These are bits. We'll keep that out. Oh, it's got some weight to it, I'll give it that. So let's have a look at it. Little tiny desk mounted tripod. It's quite wide. I'm guessing it screws onto there. There we go. That can be the little loosening thing here, so you can swivel that, tighten that up. We've also got the volume knob here. Let me look around it. It's quite, it's very heavy. I'll give it that. It's um, but it's got a nice finish to it. Um, like a matte finish. You can see that on camera. A matte finish to it. To the legs, they're quite the legs are shiny, but that's fine. Back adjuster. Seems pretty sturdy. It's made of plastic, but this is metal, metal, metal. This is metal, little metal, metal. That's metal. Majority of it's metal. Is it? That's I think that's plastic. Feels like plastic. And the cord, let's have a look at this. Looks like they're giving us a generous amount of cord, which is always a good thing. So, I'd probably say it's a. Mm, it's hard for you to say, I see on camera, but. Probably a metre and a half. Very good metre and a half worth of cabling. So, um. Just plug it in and see how it goes. Okay, can anyone hear me? I've got my, um, I'm using here a Logitech software for my Logitech camera. It's right up here, right there. And just to my left, your right, I have got the, um, yeah, the Five Iron um, microphone. So, um, you know, we're just testing what it does, see how it sounds, I mean, like that. Um, let's uh, move it from to my left, let's move it to right in front of me. Um, I've got the level set on just under half, so um, it seems like it's just picking me up. Let's, let's crank this up a bit. Put it to full, it falls a little bit too much, but um, see how this quality sounds. Um, I don't know how that will sound. 
uh, this test at the moment. Um, so if I'm gaming, I'm not going to want it sitting right in front of me. If I'm gaming, I'm going to want to let's move it back. Put my keyboard forward. I'm going to want it some like here. That blocks half my screen. So I'm clearly going to have to get a extension pole thing in BGG if I want to play games by using this. So I would have it sitting to my left preferably. So let's just stick it over here. Let's adjust it a little bit. Uh, how's the levels going? So we'll see how those go. Um, see how the clarity goes. And um, we'll have to go from there. So um, yeah, it's just a little quick test. Um, see how it goes. I really liking the quality of it. Um, up here, it's it's very heavy. Uh, not that this is a small bit of quality, but it's simply just it's sturdy. Um, yeah, simple volume adjustment. Um, it's simple. And that's what I like about it. It's very simple. So hopefully, see what the quality is like. So yeah, as I said, when I'm gaming, I'm going to be here. I've got it sitting just down here, just out of frame. You can probably see it there. So I'm sitting just to the left of my keyboard, I'm kind of sitting in my office space slash computer room, whatever you want to call it. I would be sitting like this. I would be gaming. Da 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 da. And hopefully people are picking up what I'm saying. So, um, yeah. Let's have a look. Yeah. It does come with a user's guide. Um, it does. Tell you how to obviously set it up. Plug it in. It's USB. That had to plug in. Um, and it does say that, you know, there is software you can use. It's just free. What are they called? Are they, they recommend. It was Audacity or something like that. Um, but I plugged it into a USB port and straight away just in my Logitech software for the streaming camera capturing this it it came up as one of the microphones I could use the actual one in the in the Logitech which is okay but um, yeah seems pretty good so hope you Okay, I don't know if you can hear me. Well, I've got this set on almost the bare minimum. We're doing a bit of a sound test and a quality test. Um, so, yeah, so it's about the sort of this is about. I've got a set where I was saying to my left as where I would have it for gaming. Um, so, this is the sort of minimum setting. I will now crank it up to around halfway. That's about halfway. Um, volume, it's. Um, as I said, the microphone's in a comfortable position. Um, I'm trying to get this, this glare off my freaking lot. <laughs> off my face from the screen. Um, it's about halfway, so I hope to see what the volume is. Um, let's crank it up to full. Let's have it to full. So um, it'll be interesting to see how that comes across to you, you know, you guys sitting in your living room, sitting and watching it on your. A computer or your phone or a tablet or something like that so um, so to see the phone level differences so I'm going to crack this back down to halfway this is halfway again test test one two um, and I'll you know crank it back down to near the minimum that's near the minimum setting test test one two um, and we'll see uh, see how that goes so everything seems so good so far so i can see down on my software the levels moving so as i said it moves a little bit at this level i crank it to about medium see it moving a little bit more and all the way up the top it's moving a great deal so yes there we go all right as you just saw and well, by the way before i forget I figured out there's a dark mode on the Logitech software, so that's why the glare off my glasses is not so bad anymore. Dark mode, gotta love it. So what I've obviously figured out from watching the previous part about the sound test is 
uh, the bare minimum. It's very, you know, it's a bit too, yeah. not loud enough. It's not loud enough. Um, you crank it all the way to the other end of the scale, you start getting a bit, it's, it doesn't like it. You know, it's too loud. It's my, way, way too loud. Um, you So the good setting I've got it on sitting around about halfway now seems to be about right. Um, and as I said, it's sitting to my left, I'll start sitting right in front of my face. If it's sitting right in front of my face, it'd be a little bit different. But as I said, I'm uh, gaming. I've got to have it sitting on my on my desk. Um, I have my keyboard in front of me. I have everything set up the way I want it. So if I can pick myself, pick me up, um, and I'm sitting probably, it's probably about a foot and a half away from me. Um, it's pretty good. And it sounds pretty good. This quality seems pretty good. Um, the sound quality of that is, um, as well as the build quality. I'm quite happy with it. So, um, yeah. I think this is quite a good little microphone for the price. Um, I'll have to check what I paid for it. Let's have a look. Okay. Um, the Fifine condenser microphone. I bought this off of eBay. Um, I'll just pull it up for the second page here for you. Um, so you can see um, Australian $74. Um, yeah, so um, and it got delivered um, within a week. So it was quite quick. I'm very happy about that. Um, it's an entry level price. That's $74. It's um, I think it was a good price to start off with. Hope you enjoyed this video. Michael from Tech and Tools. Um, but yeah, please hit that like and subscribe button. So, till next time, see you later.